Hey, what's up everyone? It's the CCT or the computer test for those of you who are new subscribers. So I'm going to be showing you a quick tip on how to fix Google Chrome save preference problems. Um, basically, this is what it looks like. It says your preference cannot be read. Some features may be unavailable and changes to preference won't save. So this is quite annoying sometimes. On certain days when you're trying to quickly get online and and you have to stop because of this. Um, usually you just want a browser where you click, it opens up, and boom, you're ready to go. But of course, this is a problem. And then once you click OK, it starts to load up. So I'm going to close it. So I'm going to show you how to fix it. And the first thing you got to do is go to Start, Run. I already have it typed in. And basically is the driver, the, whether it's C drive or D drive, whichever one you use, slash documents and settings, slash the user, slash local settings, slash application data, slash Google, slash Chrome. You're going to be seeing it someplace on the screen when, after I do the editing, so you don't have to worry about it. You can just pause the video and copy it down. So once you do that, click OK, this new window will pop up. And it's going to have two folders, application and user data. You're going to take user data, you're going to right click it, go to properties. Uh, here you're going to go to security tab. We're going to go to advanced. And you're going to check the last option replace permission here you go click OK and I'll prompt you with something this will remove explicitly explicitly defined permissions on all child objects and enable well you can pause the video and read it or read it yourself once it pops up click yes it's gonna take a while and let's wait see how long this takes go ahead and uh, I guess fast forward through here so you don't have to keep watching this um and another note while we wait, um, I am going to be doing another video where I will show you how to enable Java, JavaScript and Flash on your iPod. Um, I was scheduled to have the video up earlier uh, sometime last week, but the screenshots that I took came from mega video which has if you guys don't know mega video was taken down by the FBI so I now have to find another website to use as the example so as soon as I find a website then I'll transfer the pictures from my iPod to my computer and I'll start editing the video sorry about that I don't know if you guys heard it but that was just um, that was my phone I just got a text um, I'm about to turn this down. Well, that's pretty much it. And then now we're going to open up Google Chrome and see if we have the same message. So we're going to click OK. And let's open up Google Chrome. And let's see if it pops up. And so far I didn't. So I'm going to go ahead and close it. Um, and that was it. Uh, thanks everyone for watching and remember to leave a like if you find this video helpful in any way. So thanks again. Bye.